Job seekers rushed to Davis today for Yellow County's first cannabis job fair. Dozens of vendors and cultivators were at that event recruiting, and CBS 13's Angela Masalam spoke to job seekers and the Yellow Cannabis Coalition. I love cannabis. I think it's a great plant. I think it's got beautiful medical qualities. Devin Kelly couldn't be more excited about his future in the cannabis industry. The 23 year old Georgia native moved to California three years ago to capitalize on the green rush. I have worked on personal grows, I've worked on extraction sites. Um, I've made edibles before and I've done trimming. But in this ever budding industry, it's tough to translate that experience on paper. Hi, I'm Dr. Uh, Fry. Uh, nice to meet you. The taboo of cultivating cannabis is slowly starting to fade, with new laws allowing the recreational use of marijuana becoming more freely accepted. Lauren Silverstein with the Yolo Cannabis Coalition says the Green Rush is an opportunity for the county to generate more jobs and bring stability to families and the economy. If we can help in that and provide jobs, and give back through taxation and through fees. What an amazing opportunity to show that this industry is real. This is a burgeoning industry right now. Wednesday's job fair brought hundreds of job seekers and dozens of vendors looking for trimmers, cultivators, even accountants and attorneys. We're certainly following the growth of the industry. Lori Peterson works with the California Aggie, the campus newspaper for UC Davis. She's offering her advertising services to cannabis startups who are now looking for advertising opportunities. It provides just another avenue of uh, uh, a platform for these different vendors to be able to reach that community. In a post-prohibition era where rules and regulations are tight, the cannabis industry is just beginning to grow here in Yellow County. We're going to continue to put this more out in front as not something that's behind the scenes, but something that's open and it's here. And Silverstein estimates about five to 10,000 jobs could be generated around Yolo County within the cannabis industry.